Hello everyone, my name is Zeno already Secret and we are here again with another episode of The Lone Wanderer and um, this time we're gonna go to below the airfield. Um, I already have some a bit of gear that I uh, gathered in a f like a five hours I think. Like uh, it was a long trip, I spawned basically on the other side of the map and um, yeah I had to go to uh, Cherno, what was pretty difficult and uh, because it was night time. So yeah, as you can see I have a gun but no clip, I have a fireman axe. I have a backpack full of food, a helmet, I have a mask and stuff, some sunglasses, and uh, some boots. So yeah, let's play. I'm gonna jump in right now. We're going to my favorite server, because that's actually a pretty good server for lag for me. Because it's actually located in Belgium. And um, yeah, that gives me not that much ping. I um, also want to say the frame rates are not going to be that high. Um, because basically it's alpha, it's not that optimized yet for my uh, computer or just any system in general. And um, yeah, for some reason Arma is always pretty hard to record for on my computer. Um, even though I have a pretty good computer, like it's above average. So as you can see, like you can kind of see the barracks over there. Um, I'm sure if I go up a bit, like you can see them over there, maybe. Well, either way, I know it's this way. Um, but as you know, you will probably see sometimes the frames drops. Um, it's not my fault or my computer's fault. It just doesn't optimize the SLI yet in my computer, or my system in general. Oh, I can show you my gear right now. So this is what we have right now. And um, that's a good amount of gear, really. But what we want to find is um, some ammo clips. So yeah, so this um, this uh, episode we're just gonna scavenge the uh, below the airfield and kind of the military base in the back of there. Uh, in the hopes we can find some gear. And again, this is a standalone version, this is not the mod, but you probably noticed that by the UI at the start. And I think we are pretty close to the airfield right now. I actually went past it earlier when I was setting up the recording, because basically if I start recording, the, these videos are pretty hard to record um, to begin with. Because there's so much variables, other players killing you, that might ruin the whole video because I'm not gonna upload a video that's like 5 minutes long or some stuff. So I knew this one was pretty good. Because I came all the way from back to those apartments. I scavenged all of those for this gear. So it would be stupid if we get killed right now. But hey, at least we had a good amount of time. I survived for one one full day. Like full real world, real world time. Not like game time. But I guess the game time is the same as the real world time. So, I mean, we had a good run. Also, I'm recording it this time. I'm not live streaming it. Because um, the live stream quality is horrible, basically, um, for some reason. Um, it should be in 720p, f a full 720p, basically. But yet, it's still the quality is still horrible compared to my recordings on my system. And um, I just want to provide good quality. I'm not sure. Let's go over this mountain so we can see where the airfield is. If it's not over here, like right over this hill already. You just have to watch out for other players. This server is not that crowded right now because it's very early in the morning in uh, Belgium. So yeah, we might be the only guys. Wait, we can sprint, can't we? Oh yeah, we can sprint up the mountain. Let's see how many players there are. Three players. So the chances of them being in here are pretty small. But I wouldn't be surprised because this is like one of the hot spots on the map. Um, this and some other military bases. So yeah. Um, where's the valley? This is the road to the airfield, I think. I think. Um, yeah, that's the airfield up there. Or is it up here? It is up somewhere, because this is below the, That's what I know for sure, that over there. That's below the. Yeah, it's gonna be just over this hill. I'm also using no map, I haven't found a map yet, so... This is just judging by, uh, what is it, my knowledge in my head. Come on, where is it now? There it is. Okay, so we're gonna go down here in hopes we can find something. Preferably a magazine or some bags, a bigger bag would be nice. Um, even though we have to watch out because there's, um, I heard or I read about it on the reddits, that there's a bug if you drop your bag, like the one I have right now, the full one, basically it will lose all this gear. So we don't want that to happen because we have a nice amount of gear. And um, that would be a waste of my few hours. Like, I'm sure I survived like for a good... 12 hours maybe in total and most of it was just searching for food because I kept running out of food but then I found a water uh, what's it yeah a water pit or water pump in the middle of um, Cherno and also basically kept me alive for a long while 
also the quality is not on the fullest because i want to save some frames and um yeah it, i could put it on ultra i play with like i put it on ultra when i'm playing myself but when i'm recording it takes like a huge bite in my system basically of resources so i basically have to um put tone it down a bit but it still looks great in my opinion compared to the mod i mean most of the stuff is the same just the character models are a bit better i think or from what i noticed so yeah we're almost here that's the building we want to check because that's going to spawn weapons but we have to watch out oh that's a backpack we want this oh we this helmet way better come on now don't drop me that bag and now put everything back in here like we want it let my guy catch a bit of breath oh, we just can't click it we got a lot of 20 rounds but I don't know for what gun we got a lot of food and drinks as well basically we are pretty safe for a while but my connection is horrible so I don't want to disconnect right now because that would be pretty bad we have a medkit as well so if we run into a friend a friendly watch chances are pretty small like I haven't run into any friendlies um, if we catch some bacteria what's it this is good um, because if you get hit by a zombie you can't catch uh, a disease an infection and um, basically this will counter the infection boom let's even that out a bit I'm OCD like that and in this box there's a few other stuff like uh, shotgun bullets let's watch out though because now that there's stuff in here kind of looking out for other stuff as well there might be some ammo lying around what's that a bunny dead bunny because it wasn't moving so this is the point where we have to watch out for players basically but like only being three men on the server and the chances are slim of there being actual people around I mean also we have to watch out for the zombies because um, right now they can still walk through walls because um, I haven't mentioned this and I'm saying because a bit too much but this, the game is still an early alpha so um, you have to acknowledge that this game is full of bugs and um, what's that noise outside that was sound like a truck but yeah it's full of bugs and stuff and the glitches but basically we can't complain because the game is already like less buggy than the mod probably so I'm not complaining in any way the doors are open that's not kind of a good sign yeah might be looted already yep let's see always check under the bed nothing under there or beneath that nothing in here nope let's check this a book some duct tape there's currently no use for the duct taping game and I guess that's good for the crafting um, later on see this is the building I'm talking about if you drop your gear on this floor it basically will disappear for some reason a holster we already have a holster um, and there's nothing beneath there nope some bullets wait let's see these boots compared to mine the jungle boots these are damaged and mine are damaged as well I think let's see yeah both are damaged and we already have the holster so nothing in this building oh wait what's that a knife I saw some bullets as well on the bed but I already have those bullets and I kind of have a big amount of them in that little um, what's it container so we're not gonna pick them up basically I'm gonna make the round over here maybe check out the barracks over there but seeing the doors are already all open chances are pretty slim that there's gonna be anything oh my god that pole scared the hell out of me that looked like a dude I got out of the corner of my eye it scared the hell out of me let's go in here no stuff that spawns oh there when the frame the frames are actually pretty good right now I actually expected it worse but it's in that forest area Oh, he was unfortunate. Uh, what's this? A burlap? No, nothing of use for us. 
Another backpack. Another thing we are nothing with. Um, let's check this side. A crowbar. Another battery. We already have two batteries. So again, nothing for us. We are basically just looking for the uh, weapons or bullets. Either one of those. But I'm not sure if it's getting dark or sun is going up. Because that might be an issue later on. Not that I'm planning to make a two hour video, of course, but... Like, I think the server is like the other way around, basically, than the real world. Like, real world servers are like, when it's daytime in real life, it's gonna be... Um, like, light in game as well. Oh my god, not a dead person. She had nothing as well. No gears up here. It's kind of surprising how much dead people there are. Either they got hit by zombies or... A sniper. And I guess he shot from there somewhere. Like that spot up there, that must be a good sniper spot. I don't know. Oh, we just found an ammo clip. C-Mag. Yep, we found a clip with ammo. This is good. I don't know how many bullets we have right now. But this is kind of good. Um, I feel hungry. He needs to eat. He needs to eat a bit. Um, let's wait here. Um, eat the rice. Because we have a lot of rice. We need to watch out though. So we hear the footsteps. Outside. So now we will be less hungry. Okay. You have eaten some rice. Would be nice with some curry and chicken. I think it's getting dark. The good thing is that first building we went in, um, there's another one at the end, so we might still have some chance. But I'm gonna make like run a bit faster, cause um, I don't want to get um, run around in the dark, basically. Cause in this game, dark is really dark. You don't see anything. Can go in here. I'm gonna run inside of the bushes because uh, I don't want to get alerted or get caught by other people. Because not everyone is friendly in this game, surprisingly. Um, we can also look to our side while still keep running. It's a pretty beautiful game, like, even on the normal settings, some settings are even on low, I think, or even turned off, so it's not looking at the fullest. Like, these textures are most of the times way more beautiful or like more high quality textures. But I just put them on the lowest just for the sake of recording and uh, to deliver the best quality footage for you guys because I could put this on high but you wouldn't be able to watch it because it would be so frame droppy and stuff and like strainy like it would it would hurt your eyes pretty fast you have to watch out for other people's a screwdriver that's pretty handy also you have a can opener um, at the like when the game came first came out like a few days ago I think it's three days ago yeah um, the screwdrivers were one of the most rare items because basically they were the only thing that could open the cans and uh, so you had all this food but you couldn't do stuff with it um, an orange that's not good nothing under there too bad it's getting really dark really fast some boots nothing beneath here let's check these boots Damaged crap. We want the pristine ones. The good thing is there is some loot in here, so someone has left some stuff, or either no one has been here. What is that? A wrench? Yeah, that's a wrench. Like it stuck a bit in the ground. Nothing we need here. And it sounds stupid that I'm doing this, like looking under a bed. But a lot of times there's really stuff in the bed. See? A pistol. Almost missed it. Come on now. But I'm gonna put the pistol in my chest holster. Boom. And I have more backspace. Oh, he's thirsty? Let's drink a bit. We have a can of... I can't see what it is. Zlu Zlula? Yeah, I think it's Zlula. 
So, so far, the operation opera uh, operation below the airfield is pretty successful. Let's check that building over there. That's a bunny. Somehow, the animal survived this whole apocalypse. Oh, let's go in. Nothing in here. Now, let's cross to the military base on the other side. Because that's going to be pretty interesting. And after that, I'm going to head back into the woods and um, log out till it's daytime again. Because it's an, like impossible to record at night. Kind of. See, that's the base up there. And someone told me, like a friend of mine, that I have to um, watch out for the... Oh, that was Skype, I'm sorry. That I have to watch out for the... Um, I can't turn it off right now, so you might hear a few sounds. Um, now and then, but um, yeah, so a friend told me that I have to watch out for the medical tents Because these basically hold the gear, but I don't know how the military tents look Or how they like Differentiate from the other tents, so I guess a red cross on them is a military tent I'm also gonna equip my axe right now We don't want to make any noise Um uh, I guess it will like point itself out if you find gear. That's a military tent. Uh, a medical tent, right? What the hell is this? Oh, a stock? Is this better than the other one? That's the question. Great cargo pants. No use for cargo pants. So there was nothing in this one, right? Nope. Wait, was that a zombie or a player? I couldn't even tell. It's getting really dark really fast. So we have to kind of watch out. Because I don't want to end the video prematurely. Oh, another clip. It's empty, isn't it? Um, wait, let me go to my bag here. Let's see how many bullets we get. Reload, please. Well, doesn't want to do it. Let's just take it. We can check it out another time. Already have a hand guard. Don't we? Not a pistol. Like some armor would be nice. Like some body armor, a bulletproof vest maybe. Like I would appreciate that. A lot more than the stupid useless stuff we are finding right now. Gotta check out these tents, because these look like the medical tents. And yeah, some other gear. Boom, 30 rounds. That's good. Again, some body armor would be nice, but... Game doesn't care. No body armor? Or just like some tactical gear? Some tents. No zombies, surprisingly. How do I said that weird? I mean zombies. Like a tactical vest would be perfect right now. Just because there's the uh, armor options. Ah, not the armor. Um, useful stuff right now for me. I am gonna take that food though. Wait, it's badly damaged? Let's go back to that one thing over there. If we can change it to a better one, we better change it. I mean, where the hell was it? Oh my god, this is gonna be amazing! But I do want to change that that um, thingy. Where is it? Like it was here, right? Is 
Is it over here? Nope. That was just a flashlight, but we don't need a flashlight on our gun. No looting these. Basically, yeah. Nothing. I'm gonna have to look for that part maybe off camera. I don't know. Because it doesn't seem like that important right now. Because we do have the ammo and it's not that, that those machine guns are very rare at the moment. You find them, find them pretty fast. No armor? Nothing really? Come on now. Would have been nice. What the hell is this? PU scope? We're gonna put that on, can we? We can't. Um, just close this, close this, close this. Nope, that doesn't work. Okay, that's kind of strange. What was that? Nothing. Let's check out these really fast. I think I saw a dude. Combat knife? Or is that just a bayonet? What is that? A bayonet. Good. Now we have a gun with a weapon on. Flashlight, empty ammo. Come on now, give me that, that thing. Wait, we're gonna drop this basically, cause useless. And the other stuff we kind of need. So, if I just my last hope is finding that vest. A bottle of water. What's this? A suppressor? This is gonna come in handy. Like, let's take our gun in our hand. This might easy, make it a bit more easy. Um, take the suppressor. Boom. Take the bayonet. Oh, I can't do that. But I do have a suppressed um, gun right now. And it's pretty good as well. So let's go in here. Black tactical shirt. What's gonna that that gonna do for me? Nothing. I need I need the tactical vest. What's this? Badly damaged. Well, that's not... We're not gonna take that. We don't only want the good stuff. Don't we? Um, nothing in here. I am gonna go back for that, um... That's it. The, um... The barrel thing. Here it is. Badly damaged. And what's this one? Well, they're both badly damaged, so... Let's just take it. It's not that it takes a lot of backspace in, anyway. What's this? Handguard damaged. And this is a better one. We're gonna keep this one. This one isn't damaged yet. I think this is kind of it for this thing. Um, yeah. I think this was it for this military base. Let's go um, out of this. And um, go through the barracks and then we're going to go back into the woods and kind of make our chapter safe for the next episode of The Lone Wanderer. Because uh, we have some pretty good stuff right now. And we haven't encountered any zombies. It's pretty strange, I know, but um, in the standalone, the zombies are uh, not that... Like, there's not that huge packs that there was in um, 
the old Daisy, basically. Or the mod. Um, compared to this, like, now you see, like, um, for every 10 you had in the Daisy mod, you now only have 2. I like it, because the Daisy, uh, the, like, I like them far better in here, because you can actually avoid them, because if you have no gear and you get attracted by one, you're basically fucked. You didn't have anything, and um, that's pretty annoying. But now I have some decent gear, I'm pretty happy with it. Like, this is the most gear I ever had in, uh, standalone. The mask, that's pretty rare as well, from what I read on uh, Reddit. So this is the mountains we came from, back there, I think, yeah. I think I'm gonna back there as well, because that was a good spot. Not a lot of players come there right now, at least not yet, or on this server. And then I'm gonna find some supplies off camera, um, so we can continue the recording. Um... Yeah, the next, for the next episode, like I said, um, I found another military base that I want to loot. And um, I think it's going to be a fun video to make. You can't open these, no. It's kind of strange that we haven't run, run into any dudes right now. Do I lose my bullets if I... A syringe. We don't need ra that right now. These are the barracks we gotta check the floors uh, a lot. Nope, nothing. I know it sounds stupid again, but um, you actually find a lot of loot in here. Oh, body armor. UK assault vest. Oh crap. But I can replace it. Did I lose my pistol? Just now? Gonna take that pistol to the back though. I'm gonna put that ammo in here. And that other clip. So we kind of have a bit more space. This is pretty good. So we already have body armor as well. Wait, what's that? A headlamp. We already have that. That's not like I'm gonna record in the dark. Uh, let's see. I want to get that helmet. I at least want to see in what shape it is. If it's better than mine. I well, can't get to it. Probably not worth it anyway. I mean, it's not like mine is bad. And if you get shot, you will probably die. So, it's not going to make a huge difference. Nothing in here. Nope. This is the first person I don't like to play in it. Because it actually hurts my eyes pretty badly. No other players? Okay, we're safe. Let's continue. We're gonna do a few more and then I'm gonna head back. I know this is probably pretty boring for you guys. Wait, is this the green one? Cocky. I think the, the this one is better. I like this one far better. Wait, do I still have my my thing? Yeah, I do. That's very strange. Can I take it back? See, just a copy. Okay, I get it. Nothing really for us in here. Maybe I should do this first person for a second. Nothing. And let's go. Oh, a whole new gun. Let's see. M4 plastic. This is a pristine one. And these are worn. We're gonna take these boots. Oh my god, these are way better. Wait, did I just lose my vest again? Assholes. Now I have to go back. I don't want uh, to lose that magazine. Dear game. That was a good magazine. And actually, I have more spots in here? No, I don't. It's the same. Either way, game almost messed up my game plan here. It's just a burlap sack. But not much with that anyway. 
I do would like this shirt or this pants. The green cargo pants. How much is that going to change? Uh, nothing, but it camouflages us better, so we're going to take it either way. We have this gas container for no reason, basically. Oh, are we thirsty? Let's drink a bit. It's crazy when you hear this sound and you're the only one in a building. It messes with your head. That was basically it for this one. Good. Oops, sorry for Skype again. I don't want them messaging me, but yet they do. They will probably quit after a second. I'm sorry for it. Like, I might cut this up in two parts. But I'm just so happy we found all those gun parts and this body armor. It's just insane. Like, usually, I don't get that many stuff. And I die pretty um, fast. Crap, I can't get to it. Yeah, too bad. I mean, I can try to get to it, but it just seems like a waste of time. Okay. That's the last one. Good. Some drinks would be nice. We kind of need to restock up on our drinks. Nothing in the showers, of course. That would be disgusting. See, that's the building where I'm probably going to loot off camera um, for the drinks. Because it's pretty easy to find some drinks over there. Guess this was it for um, this episode. Yeah, let's check out that building and then I'm gonna go back to that um, thingy. Um, the mountain over there. Log out and um, call it a day for this episode. Because I think we got a lot of stuff and did pretty good. Pretty happy with it. Like we have a good amount of military loot right now. And it's pretty rare to have that. So I want to get the hell out of here. And um, probably never come back. <laughs> it's that easy. I hope my microphone is recording all this sound. Because that would be pretty sucky as well. And this isn't a standard server by the way. It's not like uh, this is a server with high loot spawns. It's very strange. Is that a zombie? No, that's a rock. Let's check this building for a bit of water. Or drinks. Oh, that's my cell phone. I'm sorry for that. I had to wake up. And sorry for that again. People keep annoying me, and I keep annoying myself. With the cell phones. I can't drink from this pit, so... I just bought DayZ. Oh my, Super Game Cat just bought DayZ. This is good. But um, we're not going to care about him just for a second. Because we have to get the hell away from here. This is an extraction operation. And um, because we have all our valuable loot. I mean, look at us. We're looking straight up gangster. Come on now. Wait, what was that? That looked like a dude for a second. Come on now. Oh, this is the uh, first person you can shoot like this. It's all over the place right now. Because I probably need some food soon. And some drinks. Like, next episode, we're probably going to go in that direction. To a military base that's located. This is new. Um, it isn't in the mod. Uh, with that, I mean. So... I've never been there myself, but uh, I'm sure it's uh, a pretty high hotspot for um, all the people. Basically, because um, it is new, first of all, and it's pretty um, a good spot to go to if you're spawned all the way in that corner. Because basically, other than that, there's nothing there, so everyone's probably going to run there um, when they spawn in Kamenka. Um, yeah, so... Things after this hill is probably a good spot to log out. That's uh, a huge part away from uh, where we came from. 
And uh, I don't think a lot of people will come to here. What's that? A feeding stand? It's not like that will spawn weapons, does it? Crap, why are there so many buildings nearby? Let's go to the green uh, thingies. I'm sorry for stretching it a bit too long, but... I like uh, the green forest a bit better because it's more dense. And it can't spot you uh, too good in it. Oh, this is where we came from, basically. Yeah, I remember this river. We basically started all the way up there. See, if I log out in here, they probably can't see me as well. Why does it want to reload my magazines every damn time? Okay. A bit further. Come on now. I don't like the red trees for some reason. They don't provide any good cover. Yeah, this is where I'm going to log out, guys. So, yeah, I want to thank you guys for watching. And, um, yeah, see you in the next episode of The Lone, Lone Wanderer. Um, so, next episode, we're probably going to go to the military base, check out some other loot, and just check out the base in general, because I haven't been there, and I really want to see it myself. And uh, especially with this awesome loot, we might encounter players, but we will probably be able to kill them. Um, but first of all, I probably have to go and uh, search, for for, search for some drinks myself. Um, but that's going to happen off camera, so I don't have to bother you guys with that boring process. So yeah, see you guys next week in another episode of The Lone Wanderer. Bye.